Hello, my name is Joe, a student at JTEC in Jacksonville, Florida here. And today we're going to talk about uh, testing batteries with the NAPA MDX-225. Uh, this type of tester is becoming more of the industry's, uh, industry standard because <clears throat> it gives you the capability of printing out the results of the test. Uh, that's important to companies that manufacture the batteries. If there's a warranty issue, the battery can be sent back with the printout. So, first thing we're going to do is uh, safety. Put on our safety glasses. Uh, if you have rubber gloves, that's recommended, uh, or a full face mask, apron, uh, protect your eyes, skin from uh, potential uh, battery exposure, battery acid exposure. If you're wearing any rings, watches, jewelry, like a necklace that hangs down, you would also want to remove those. So we're going to hook this on up to our uh, uh, positive terminal. Negative to negative. And you'll see the uh, machine turns on. Uh, voltometer right now is reading 12.4. Uh, that could go as high as 12.65. <clears throat> the next part of the test is going to ask you a bunch of questions about your particular vehicle. Uh, the first one is a battery location. So obviously that's in the um, vehicle, uh, engine compartment. It's a top post, group 31, uh, regular flooded battery. We're going to go with the uh, battery standard uh, 800 CCA rating. That's called cranking amps. That's the number of amps required to actually crank the engine over. So it's going to run through the test here. Uh, we are currently above 32 degrees in Jacksonville, Florida. And this is going to be before charge. So as you can see, the volts again are reading 12.4. Uh, the amps were 699, and uh, the rating, of course, was 800. That's what we entered earlier. Um, next thing we can do with this is if we uh, hit enter, we're going to be able to uh, check the starting system. So the first thing it tells us to do is start engine. Cranking was normal. Press enter for the charging test. Checking out the alternator output. Rev engine with loads off. So for this, I'm going to shut the door just to make sure a dome light isn't on or something along those lines. <coughs> okay, now it's telling me to go ahead and idle the vehicle. Testing the alternator at idle with the loads off. Now it's asking for uh, high beams here and blower motor. So I've got the blower motor on, uh, idle engine. It's going to test uh, the alternator at idle with loads on. Now it's asking me to rev the engine. Uh, now it's telling me to go back down to engine idle. Turn the loads off. And the engine. Enter. Charging system had no problems. You can see the no load. Uh, the alternator looks like it was putting out 14.09 uh, volts. And with it loaded, it was putting out 13.91. Uh, which is within uh, standards. All right, well, that's basically how you use the uh, NAPA MDX-225. Test your uh, auto battery and starting system.